Welcome to one week of outfits from my winter 10 item capsule wardrobe. Hi everyone, Jennifer here and welcome back to The Daily Connoisseur. I have another Outfits of the Week video for you today. I'm sharing what I'm wearing the next week and it's winter here in Southern California so you get to see how I style my 10 item wardrobe to fit the weather. Today's video is sponsored by Native Deodorant. I will get into the deodorant later on in the video but for now let's look at today's outfit. So today I'm wearing the Sky Desi dress. This is from my fall wardrobe that I transitioned into my winter wardrobe. And I love this. I actually think this dress is more appropriate for winter because I like to layer it. So I'm wearing it with the black opaque hip stick tights. These tights are the absolute best. They never ride down and it's because they have that lace elastic at the top. I've never had a pair of tights or hose that were this good. So I love them. And I'm wearing them with my Thursday captain boots. You know, my favorite, they give this a very Victorian vibe. On top of it, because it's so cold outside, I'm wearing the Mercy Hampton duster. And this acts as like a sweater coat. Now, if I were living in a really chilly climate, let's say it was snowing or freezing, I could wear my really thick black wool trench coat. But because it's still a relatively mild winter, the Mercy Hampton Duster does the trick for keeping me warm. I like to pair this look with a scarf and I've tried different things and I hope my hair's not messy because I just put this on and didn't even check in the mirror. But this is an infinity scarf. It's a faux fur scarf that I've had for several years and I like to bring it out at Christmas time. I really like wearing this when I go to England because it keeps me very warm. So um, this one is really old. I'll try to find similar ones and link them down below. But I love the textures here with this outfit. I like the velvet houndstooth of the dress, the cashmere sweater, the faux fur, um, shawl and then the leather boots. I like that juxtaposition there. And I think that this is a very chic way to stay warm. Another way I like to wear this look is with that green tartan um, shawl that I have, and that's really old as well. That one I got on Zoo Lily for a really good price. So I think altogether, this is one of my favorite winter looks. Also, when I'm walking around the house, I just wear my isotoner slippers with this. I'm not wearing my boots around the house. Hello, it's the next day, and today I'm wearing the J. Jill Charcoal Wrap Dress. This dress was a really good purchase. I purchased it uh, last, the year before last, and I love this dress because it's such a neutral and it's such a staple, and you can dress it up and dress it down and layer it in so many different ways. So you've never seen me wear it like this, but I'm wearing a cropped uh, sweater over it. Now, I don't know if I've ever shown this sweater to you before. I bought this from Morning Lavender a few years ago, and do you know how I actually wear this sweater? This is probably why you've never seen it. I wear this at night over my Montel Intimates chemises or over my nightgowns. So that, sometimes that's what I like to do. Instead of wearing a big bulky robe, when I wear those little chemises, I will wear, this is like a ballet, cropped ballet sweater almost. And I don't know if they still do them. I will look down below. I absolutely love this sweater and I thought, I wonder if it's going to look good over the J. Jill dress and it does. And it just provides that extra layer of warmth that I need for the winter. I think it's super chic and I like uh, that the bow kind of peeks out here. On my legs, I'm wearing the hip stick sheer tights. Again, that adds another layer of warmth. For my shoes, these were a Christmas gift that my mother-in-law sent me. She actually designed them and they're just beautiful. I love them so much. By the way, this week, I've been doing very neutral nail polish. This is Cheerio by London Town. And I think, let me focus back on my face. I have just been wearing such deep, heavy colors for Christmas that I wanted something very fresh and uh, clean for the new year. So these are very royal nails today, cheerio. That is it for today, and I will see you tomorrow. Before we move on with the outfits, Native Deodorant have sponsored today's video, and they have a brand new product line. They have 0% plastic used in their new packaging. So Native Plastic Free was created for customers who asked for non-plastic packaging. Their team has been passionately working on this project for nearly a year and a half and is so excited to see it come to life. The ingredients for a native are aluminum free, paraben and sulfate free. They also contain familiar ingredients such as coconut oil and shea butter. 
They're also vegan and cruelty free. I love that they dry quickly and that they're not sticky and they don't leave a white film on my clothing. As for scents, it's one of my favorite thing about this deodorant line. I chose their coconut and vanilla, the citrus and herbal musk, and their lavender and rose. Those are the three classics I love from them. Three plastic free deodorants are normally $39, but if you use my link and code dailyc 2 you'll get them for $29. That's 25% off. Thank you to Native for sponsoring today's video. Hello everyone, it's the next day, and today I'm wearing my favorite piece in my wardrobe currently, and that is this jumpsuit from Velvet by Graham and Spencer. And I shared this in my winter wardrobe updates. It's the only new piece that I have in my winter wardrobe. And I feel happy in it. I feel playful in it. Can you tell how much I love this jumpsuit? <laughs> so I'm wearing the jumpsuit with the Lily Silk camisole and I have a little silk scrunchie to match. And the shoes that I like to wear this with are the Oliver Cabell mules. Now, I know that it's winter time, so I could also wear lace-up boots if it's really cold outside, like the Captain boots from the Thursday Boot Company. I mean, obviously, if it gets warmer, I could wear sandals with it. And then if it's freezing, I could pop a coat on over it or wear a big shawl. But as of right now, the temperature is pretty mild today. So this is what I'm wearing. My makeup today is very minimal. I'll have all my makeup details down below. Today we're doing a lot of physical work around the house. So I thought that I would dress in my utilitarian jumpsuit to suit the task. So that is today and I will see you tomorrow. Hi everyone. I have the baby right outside the door playing Hot Wheels. So. That's what that noise is. Um, today is a little bit later on in the morning. We had a really busy homeschool morning and we're still in the midst of it. So I just popped up here to film my outfit. And today I'm wearing the Draper James chambray shift dress uh, with the Everlane cashmere sweater. I know it's a rather unusual combination, um, but I love it. I like how it's a bit preppy and very classy and classic. And this is keeping me warm. So I'm wearing this with the hip stick tights. And we were outside and one of my daughters said, your legs look so silky. I think that's what she said. And then I, I said, yeah, I'm wearing tights. And she, she didn't realize that I was wearing pantyhose on. So that's good. That's how good those tights are. They, it looks like your real legs. And so that is what I'm wearing today along with the ballet flats. And I have pearl earrings because I'm just feeling classy today. <laughs> As for my makeup, it's a little different today. This is what I would typically wear on a regular day when I'm not filming for YouTube. I just wanted to show what that would look like. Um, so I'm gonna be doing a review of the brand that I'm wearing. It's called Merit. It's a really cool minimalist makeup brand. So look out for that coming up on the channel. But this is typically what I will look like on any given day that I'm not filming for YouTube. <laughs> so this is somewhat of a 60s look and I'm really enjoying it. So that's it for today, and I will see you tomorrow. Today I'm in my winter whites. This is the cream-colored cashmere sweater from Mont and Beau, and I'm wearing the Lily Silk camisole underneath. I like to have that little layer of protection, and I like the textures of silk and cashmere together. It's so cozy and warm. And I'm wearing my Mont and Beau mom jeans. And then on my feet, I'm wearing the Thursday Captain boot, my favorite boot, I love them. So this is a really simple look. My makeup is pretty minimal. We're gonna be spending some time outside today. So it's all very casual and simple. That is today and I will see you tomorrow. Hi everyone, it's the last day in this video and today I'm wearing the Lily Silk blouse. This is that romantic pirate looking blouse that I love so much with the black, Mott and Bow jeans, the Oliver Cabell mules because it is a mild, sunny winter day outside today, and this long cardigan that I have from Land's End. I've had this for a few years and I really like it. I love a tie waist anything because it cinches the waist and it looks very elegant. I'm also having a bad hair day, so I'm wearing my leopard headband and I like to do that, especially when I'm having a day where I kind of need to cover up my hair. I think it looks really chic and elegant. My makeup is very natural today and I do need to paint my nails, but luckily the nice thing about wearing a nail polish that is so light and similar to your nail color is that you can't really tell. Thank you so much for watching my outfit of the week video. I hope it gave you lots of style inspiration to look your best every day. Remember the first 100 people to click on the link below for the plastic free 
Native Deodorant will get 25% off and free shipping. Thank you to Native for sponsoring today's video. Thanks again for watching and I will see you next time on The Daily Connoisseur. Bye everyone.